Okay guys, Assalamu alaikum. Welcome to day 6 vlog in Dubai. So today I thought I'd start my vlog with a little tour of the hotel as I didn't really do this in my previous vlogs. So the hotel is called Al Bandar Rutana in Dubai Creek. It is a 5 star hotel and it was absolutely amazing. The hotel has a kids club for children and also has multiple restaurants inside it. One being the infamous Gusto restaurant which was part of my day one vlog. If you want to see that you can go back. So this is the dining area where we would have breakfast in the morning. First thing I thoroughly enjoyed the breakfast. It was absolutely amazing. Everything was delicious. I have showed that as well in my first Dubai vlog. So please do go check that out. The hotel itself is beautiful. The interior is amazing. okay so we started our day with raising canes now this is really famous on tiktok it's known for its dipped chicken tenders and that's exactly what we were going for now we did actually decide to start off our sort of Jumeirah experience with lots of food and uh, this was a great place to start with now the chicken tenders were absolutely amazing i wasn't really fond of the iced tea um it just was bland and lacked flavor for me but the chicken tenders the fries were delicious and with the dipped sauce it was just 10 10. to urban lobster rolls and fish and chips and fish and chips a limited iced tea and a Caesar salad from urban seafood Caesar salad So yeah, we started our food journey with something salty, so the chicken tenders, amazing, fish and chips, really, really nice. And then I was like, you know what, I have to try the infamous Cheesecake Factory. The aesthetic in this place was 10-10, just look at it, wow. 
um, the interior, the ambience, the staff, everything was really, really good. So my sister got this like iced tea again, it wasn't very nice, not very flavoured. And we all got a sort of cheesecake each because we just wanted to try something different, go all out kind of thing. Now, I do feel this place is just for Instagram pictures, videos, etc, TikToks because the cheesecakes themselves, I'll be completely honest, I've had better in the UK. I did expect the cheesecakes to be amazing and delicious and just wow, the way they looked to be honest, but never mind, I was a bit disappointed with Cheesecake Factory. Once we ate from there, we were stuffed and we said that's it, now no more food, we'll end our food journey here. And we carried on in just spending our evening in Jumeirah Beach and just having a little tour around seeing what it's all about now the vibe here is totally different to where we were staying in dubai creek and here we are in smoky beach beautiful beautiful location so chill vibes i would definitely recommend visiting here so we got some mocktails from here and just sat by the beach and yeah just chilled pretty much the remainder of the evening didn't really go to any beaches and during our Dubai trip to be honest we didn't really get the chance so yeah this was our first experience on a beach in Dubai and yeah I really really enjoyed it as you can see the sunset and we were just sat there by the beach just chilling enjoying our calm and stress-free evening Masha and the Bay Cafe Masha and the Bear Got a Masha there Size B in Dera city center well, we actually ended our day visiting Dera city center and everything was pretty much closed because it was 10 pm the only thing open was the food court so we tried this place and the food is actually really nice and that was an end to an amazing amazing day i hope you enjoyed my today's vlog in dubai I would definitely recommend visiting Jumeirah if you're on holiday in Dubai. Now I did have a little nice surprise when I got into the room by the hotel. So we had some little sweet trees, chocolate and some fruit. So thank you so much. Alban the Rotana. Please make sure to like, share and subscribe if you enjoyed today's video. Allah is.